Three stores are now putting limits on how much meat each customer can buy at once. They're bracing for a possible shortage as more plants across the country shut down. WBZ's Lisa Greshi has more. More people are going grocery shopping more often and they're spending more money. First, toilet paper was the issue. Now, it's meat. The uh, chicken, for example, nothing. Couldn't actually get any uh, of the ground beef or any like steak or chicken. Costco, Stop and Shop, and Wegmans are among the supermarket chains now limiting the number of meat items per customer. It's only two of each item, so like you're going to get like two things of chicken, two things of uh, beef, uh, like two things of bacon. At Wegmans, for example, you can only get two packages of ground beef at a time. Most shoppers understanding this doesn't mean it's time to stock up. I'm just hoping that people don't, uh, you know, go off the deep end just because there's some limits that are that are taking place. Just take what you need, I guess. Limits are okay. Do you actually need like six, like you know, things of chicken? No. We spoke with retail analyst Ken Morris, who says it all comes back to supply and demand. He also fears people will start panic buying. Now we're going to have people hoarding meat. You know, that's that's uh, that's going to be a reality. From coast to coast, dozens of processing plants have shut down because of the coronavirus. Decreasing supply while demand is high. Moore says meat prices have gone up in the past few days. It's a trend he's seen with other items like eggs and orange juice. And it's not, I'm not all on the retailers. The suppliers are uh, charging more to the retailers. They're passing it on to the consumers. And I don't think they're gouging anyone. I think the prices are definitely going up, though. Experts don't expect this trend to last. That is, if processing plants can reopen and reopen soon. The advice remains, though, if we all want to get through this together, please only buy the items you need when you go grocery shopping. Reporting in Medford, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.